kuna jambo tunafaa kufanya. The Lord said we need to pray for our doctors and our clinical officers and our nurses of this country. There is a plan from the devil. Doctors may not understand this. They don't operate in the invisible. They somehow, madaktari wengi wanaamini. Listen to this. Many doctors believe that there is a devil. And they believe that there is a God. But they don't know how the devil works. And there is a plan from the devil to take advantage of this pandemic and they kill so many medics. And the Lord said this church has to stand for the Kenyan medics. They have a role to play in his kingdom. Praise God. And so I request you to stand. We are going to pray for them for the next five minutes. We are praying for our medics. Hallelujah. We are praying for everyone that works in hospital. We are losing medics. And some people think that it is because of negligence that the government is not doing enough. However much the government may do enough, the devil is also working to use even negligence to kill doctors. We have never lost as many doctors as we have lost now. And many of us are seated here. We don't know how many we are likely to lose very soon. Now, ninyi mulifunja matabau za shetani. Na hii ni December, shetani anafaa kuwa na watu wengi waliokufa kupitia kwa ajali. Lakini kwa bahati mbaya, mukafunja hizo maajali, mukabadilisha. So the devil amepaki bila matabau za ajali. Sasa anakwenda kutumia hii kitu inaitwa mgomo wa madaktari kupata ile namba anataka but we are telling the devil today it is not going to work in the name of Jesus Hallelujah Hey Are we together Kwa hiyo kuna mgomo wa madaktari ambao shetani anataka kuutumia kuua wa Kenya wengi lakini pia hii pandemic anataka kuitumia kuua madaktari Atuwezi kuwa na kilio cha madaktari Kenya. Atuwezi. Atuwezi. You know, you know you are talking about people who is highest in in your academic uh, system. So how can the devil just clear people like that and our women still need to give birth? Accidents are, are, are still happening and our people need attention. Our watu it, it is it is so insensitive. Hata hata nilisikia watu wengine wanasema ati sio madaktari peke yao wanakufa wa Kenya ni wengi wanakufa you cannot equate wa Kenya na madaktari those are people who work off duty ni watu wametoa maisha yao kufanya vitu watu wasi kufanya nasema ukweli ninafanyaga maoperation zangu hapa za kiroho lakini ikifika ma operation za mwili kuna mama mwingine mwasi kufumilia hao watu wanafumilianga why did they may not know what i know i must also accept i don't know what they know but I can agree that they are defenders of life. And anybody that defends life, we must defend. Those people are defenders of life. And anyone that is in defense of life is in the... Uyo mtu ako upande wetu. Watu ambao atu waombei ni wachawi because they don't defend life, they kill life. Doctors are not witches. They are defenders of your life. Praise God. Hallelujah. We cannot be in a country like we don't know what we are doing there. This is our country. It is not anybody's property. It was given to all of us by God. We have one God. And therefore, this one God that we have has already done something. We are getting our priorities wrong. But unless there is a man to pray, there will be no God to answer. Now that men have prayed, there is a God to answer today. Welcome to Gospel Embassy Chapel and be spiritually nourished by Pastor Peter Murwabi. Skriza, shetani yupo na lazima tumujulishe kwa basisi pia tumemfahamu mungu. You can also watch the powerful and uplifting sermons live on YouTube channel every Saturday.
from now going forward nobody in this church is dying before the time in jesus name don't forget to subscribe to the channel by clicking on the subscription button on the right for all prayer requests and information call the number on the screen first corinthians 2 verse 4 my message and my preaching were not with wise and persuasive words but with the demonstration of the spirit's power gospel embassy network tv the place to feed on heavenly bread